Welcome to Microsoft Excel 101 Introduction to Excel brought to you by MyOnlineLearningPartner.com and 599CD.com. I am your instructor, Richard Rost, and I can be reached at Richard at MYOLP.com. What are the objectives for today's class? We're going to learn about Microsoft Excel, the parts of the screen, entering and editing data, formatting cells. We're going to work with some basic math calculations. We're going to teach you functions. What are functions? You'll find out in a few minutes. Cut, copy, and paste. We're going to teach you autofill. We're going to learn how to save and load our workbooks. And we'll show you how to print your spreadsheets. Our goal with Excel 101 is to get you up and running quickly. All of our 101 classes are pretty much designed to get you using the software in a minimal amount of time. We'll cover a lot more of the details in our future classes, but for today, our focus is to get you working with Excel, to get you creating a spreadsheet, and to be productive in about an hour. Prerequisites. The prerequisites for this course are Windows 101, Introduction to Computers, and either Windows 102, Introduction to Windows 98, or Windows 110, Introduction to Windows XP. We will assume you are familiar with Windows, how to move around, and how to use the keyboard and mouse. It is also recommended, though not required, that you take our Word 101 class first as well. A lot of the topics we'll cover today, like saving and loading documents, cut, copy, and paste, and printing, are the same between Word and Excel. And we cover them in a lot more detail in our Word course because we recommend people watch the Word course first and then move on to Excel. So again, Word is not required, but it will be helpful if you watch that before this class. Versions used. We will use Microsoft Excel XP, the 2002 edition, and Windows XP in this course. Most of the material, however, covered in today's course will be the same regardless of what version of Excel or Windows you use. If you have Excel 2000 or Excel 97 or even Excel 95, pretty much all the information covered in today's course will be the same for you. Likewise, if you have Windows 98 or Windows 95 or even Windows 2000, pretty much all the information covered in today's class will be the same for you as well.